Well, I don't know if they understand, but I always tell them, when I come over here, what happened, you know. I came here on the boat to Southampton, and when I came off the boat, I was excited because I see all this smoke coming out of the chimneys, you know, and I said, boy, England is good because look how much factories are here. Because I didn't know they were coming out of people's houses. I thought they were all factories, you know. And then we took the train to Waterloo. It was very cold in those days. Very, very cold. And really a bit struggled because everywhere we go to look a job, before you even get to see the boss man, they tell you no vacancy. And then we couldn't get anywhere to live either. Because everywhere you go, to, you, you see they put up a sign if, if they have any place to live. They said no blacks, no dogs, and no Irish, and no kids. <laughs> So the only person that used to help us in those days was the Jew people. But they will lend, um, rent you a little baby room and they will charge you like twice the amount of rent. And then everybody used to live room, 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 room and share this the bathroom, share the kitchen. Why didn't you apply for council housing? They had um, council houses but not for the blacks, only for the whites. But because we couldn't get council house, it make us more ambitious. Because we lived in a little baby room, we want to get out of it. And then now, uh, you know, you have one little man now who's fortunate um, to get a job. And he saved his money and saved his money. And then he buy a house. And then when he get his house now, he start rent room rooms. <laughs> But it was really, really hard. And Herman? Cool, man. When I mean cool, I mean cool. Because the, the, when you come in the 60s, and you come in December, I tell you something, it was high switch everywhere. And in those days, they talking about coal, not Mickey Mouse, like what happened now, you know. For days that I should be in that store, I thought my little old heart was going to burst because it's so cool. After coming from a hot place and all of a sudden you like going to a fridge any or a cold storage you know it was very very cool i used to work with my father he's decorating well we call it painted back home but over here they call it decorating so when they come over here and ask to do start with decorating cold place he's a working pubs so i didn't i only said i have a hard life at home my sticky time is only when when you have a problem in your lifestyle, like wives, keep away from those people really. <laughs> you know, far away from them, not my business. <laughs> but otherwise, it's, it's fine. I, I think life is it's fine with me, really. Do you remember the Notting Hill and Brixton riots? I think we was here at that time, was it? Yes, we was here. here yeah. We, we come here in the 60s, in the 69, we are coming in 1960. And I think that's what happened, but we wasn't even in Paddington at the time. We were away from that, really. That yeah, we, we, we hear so about them, but... We never, we yeah. wasn't here really, because we wasn't, you know, we was... We, we was here, 60. we was living in this country. When they used to have all of the riots in, in um, Brixton, Riots, you know, black and white and all this. Yeah, they never know about Brixton on because we don't we don't venture out Paddington. We don't venture we don't nothing out. either. We don't. That's just the, where where I live in in, in Paddington. It's just down the bottom of the road from we. You could walk it really, Jesse. Do you believe in God? Yes. Yeah, you I believe it? So. Yeah. Yeah. Don't think so. You you must know. Well. Sometimes, because sometimes things happen in your life, and you say, boy, there was a God, dear boy, I'm going to start this thing out for you, and it should make you suffer, you know, something, and it works. Because it's my God, there's somebody up there who really likes me, you know. I do believe in God, but, but, but I believe in God in a different way. I don't think he's in heaven, and I don't think there's hell. 
I think that God is like nature, the, like the sun, the moon, and the star. That's how he can be everywhere. And I believe if you're suffering and you have a hard life, you're in hell. And if you can find your way out, you know, like you can find your food and your rent and your bills, you're in heaven. I, I think heaven and earth is right here, but yeah. right on earth. Yeah. Yes, right here. I believe that. I don't think anything up there because when, you, when you're six foot and you went under the water and threw some dirt, I don't know where you go, but I think the spirit just disappear where it go. I don't know. I don't know. I don't believe in spirit. I, I think, think so. I think when a person die, they just die. And there's yeah, no the coming body. back and there's no ghost and there's nothing. And that's the body. I don't believe in that's that. The I, think it? I think it, it's the just in people's mind. It has to cock because I think the spirit does leave the body. That's my opinion. I think the spirit, when it leaves the body, where it go, I don't know. But I think it goes somewhere. It don't go anywhere. It's just, it's just die. From it leave your body, it's just die. <laughs> I think the spirit goes somewhere. People could have tried it off. In the I air. don't know. I don't know. I just not believe. If you had three wishes, what would they be? Well, the first one would have to be good health. That's that's the main one. And the next one is that all all my children and my grandchildren are good citizens in the world. I always pray for that and long life. Now my one is will be good health. No woman. Because I think they wanted to <laughs> troublemaker and this girl. Come on, you come and keep quiet. And then, then, then the next thing is keep away from marriage. That's my opinion. And who knows it? Who feels it knows it. And I have experience of it. So I can only talk from my experience. I'm dif I'm di I'm, I am different from him there because I had a good marriage and I have him and he's a good man. If I have my life to live all over again, those are to try to eat proper, have good health, keep away from marriage, keep away from woman. And if you look in this world, women always make trouble. They're unpredictable. You don't know where you stand with them. They are nice today. They are moody. They are.